It's uh, JP from uh, NewEnglandCopChases.com. We have uh, a search and seizure right here. See it better. This must be part of that ghost unit. Hey, you know, but listen, I don't care if you feel much, but you're not gonna be this close. So moving on that way, okay? You don't yeah. need to be so close to me. Yeah, sir. I do. I'm gonna make sure you get out of here. You gotta go all the way back to that driveway right there, if you could. Okay? Oh, really? Yeah. Well, I'll see you in court then, sir. So what? I haven't done anything. Yeah, you're moving me out of the way for, for freedom of recording you. That's what you're I doing. I don't care if you record me. You're gonna do it back there, though. It's called officer safety. Officer safety. Yeah. So you let those people go right by you. I had them on camera. You didn't let them move away. I didn't even know they were there, sir. Five freaking Keep going. people just... Keep going. What's your name, sir? Badge number? It's Detective Brown. Detective Brown? Yep. All right, I'll see you soon. Can't wait. I have an active lawsuit against go. you, man. Not me. Yeah, you. No. You guys, yeah. No, no not yeah. me, though. Yeah. So this is not far enough? No, the corner's far enough. Oh, the corner? Yep. So you're basically hindering me from getting anything that you have yeah, you action here. I have a here. video camera with zoom on it. Get going. Zoom on it? Get your supervisor here right now. It's not working tonight. You don't have a supervisor tonight? I do. It's not working. All right, then call the state police. You call them. I'm you're under citizen's anybody. arrest. No, I'm not. Keep yeah, going. you are. Keep I'm going. just putting you under citizen's arrest. Okay. Try laying a finger on me so it happens to you. Oh, is that a threat? Are you, you accosting me? No, no. Are you it's illegally accosting me? Warning you. That's not a warning. That's yep. a threat, sir. No, it's not. Man, you need to learn who you're talking to, man. I know who I'm talking to. You do who? Okay. You're cool right here, dude. Who am I? Don't move. Well, it's up to me to determine my safety, sir. You just moved me out of the zone of free press. Detective douche. So this is an uh, unreasonable response, uh, so I can't, I cannot pick up anything uh, 
what's going on here because he uh this douchebag brown guy moved me out of the way so I can't pick up anything because he's a fucking dickhead they want to do things illegal that's why they don't want you to see them Uh, it's like uh, six three four six seven. Howdy. Howdy. Yo, uh, Lieutenant Detective Brown's a dickhead, man. He doesn't like uh, like the press watching him. Hey, can I speak to a supervisor, please? It's a concerned citizen. Oh, whoever your supervisor is. What's that? I can't I can't hear that well. Yes, please. Yo, oh, I see. <laughs> hey Lieutenant Mucci, how are you? This is JP, how you how you doing? Hey uh I know I haven't talked to you in a while. Hey I'm I'm trying I was trying to videotape this uh stop. Um, I don't know uh, what street this is because I don't know Manch that well. Do you know what street this is, sir? Ma'am? Street? Yeah. It's Main Street. It's Main Street. Um, there's an unmarked car here. I was at a... What's that? JP. <laughs> Why well, I filed a complaint on you. It was founded because you didn't file a complaint on my behalf. You don't remember that? JP, Matt Phillips, <laughs> NewEnglandCopChases.com. Yeah, you know me. Oh, that is my real name. <laughs> it's Matthew John Paul Phillips. <laughs> Matthew J.P. Phillips, that is my real name. <laughs> um, I'm here videotaping a uh, traffic stop with an unmarked car. I was at a pretty safe distance. You know I've been doing this for a very long time and I was threatened by a Lieutenant Brown, Detective Brown. Um, I told him to not walk so close to me. And he says, why don't you put your hands on me and see what happens. He moved me pretty much, I would say maybe 25 to 50 yards away. Um, so I can't see or hear anything. So he hindered recording. I was at a, at least a five, six car lengths away from the stop. And he walked right up to me with a flashlight in my face. He obscured the, obscured the camera. And now I'm at a point where I can't get the interaction at all. So he's hindering uh, freedom of the press and, and the freedom of right to record. Well, he let he he literally let seven uh, citizens walk right by him, and I have that on video. And he he didn't say anything to them, and they walked literally right next to their car and walked by them. He uh, literally walked and chest bumped me all the way to the corner, so he actually physically touched me. So I want to file a criminal complaint on simple assault on him. <laughs> Well, I gotta, I, I gotta be in a court case in uh, Boston, Mass tomorrow, so I'll probably just email her. <laughs> All right, so you're you're, fa you're failing to uh, take the complaint now. You're refusing to. Oh, 
Okay, because I was told it goes to the OIC first. That's how the process works. Though so I'm just reacting now. I mean, you were in trouble for this before. You know, you you feel. Actually, I got the letter. The letter says my complaint on you was sustained, sir. Well, I'll email it to you because if you're lying to me right now, I'll just get you on another complaint on that. No. Alright, well that's not how the process works, so, so I'll just file another complaint on you then. Well, you, you keep sticking up for your juice bag cops, man. <laughs> Attitude reflect leadership, that's how it is, you know? That's how it is. Have a good night. Okay, so, uh, you guys, uh, you guys like uh, employing people that commit assaults, huh? I don't employ anybody. City of well, one of your cops assaulted some old lady down in Mass, pending charge, right? Mass? Yeah, down the cape. It was all over the news, man. I know you're not stupid. Well, you guys acted, but... I'm not a free stater, man. You never said you were. I'm telling you I'm not. Oh. I don't care what you said. You guys can't be trusted. You guys here for me? Why are you standing next to me? Because I can't. Am I not allowed to? Well, you're posing me as a threat, so can you please move it along? Nope. Why? Because I felt like standing right here. You felt like standing? Well, you're in uniform, man, and I'm above you, so why don't you move it along? Okay. The public has jurisdiction over you, <laughs> not the other way around, bad bully. Who, what's your name and badge number? Olson, 5-9. Olson? Yes, sir. And yours, man? Yeah, thank you. So, uh... <laughs> basically, uh, what's going on here is I was removed, as you can see in the video, um, from uh, that pole just beyond that uh, traffic stop. And um, he literally chest bumped me all the way to this position. And it wasn't a lawful order, and he threatened me in the process. Um, this is that ghost unit. Um, and it's like, it feels like like 20 below out. I'm gonna go in my bag and get winter gear, so don't get fucking jumpy and bitchy on me, all right? I got no weapons, just my mouth. <laughs> Wow, you guys really don't like people watching you, huh? If I can hear and make sure this citizen's safe up there for an illegal search and seizure. Because uh, Manch likes to break the law. You guys need to read, read fucking Glick vs. Cunniff, man. Cannot hinder the right to record. can't invoke laws to stop recording. <laughs> Traffic stops in the public need to be corded off. If they are not, we can even get at arm's length according to your justices. So we'll just attach this in the injunction I already have against the Manch PD. So I'm sure Captain Tessie is going to love that.
I like to file a complaint on the fucking Manchester PD and not give you guys a good winter gear. Holy shit. Another one. <laughs> <laughs> 